Tim Sedgwich writes, hey guys, love the show. I'm a bit concerned though with the ambivalence that John seems to show for every television property. Ambivalence! <laughs> I am ambivalent to your cries. <laughs> that people suggest for a feature film treatment. Every time his response seems to be meh, the sh that show isn't that popular since it isn't even in the top 50 or 25 or 10, depending on which show is being discussed. So why would people pay to see that? He even suggests that Doctor Who is not really that popular as to support a major motion picture. May I point out that Veronica Mars, which is nearing $6 million in fan support at its best, was number 138 over 142. Does he really think that Doctor Who would do fewer numbers than M Veronica Mars? I propose that a Who movie with the properties of millions of fans in the 40 plus countries in which it is shown first run would almost certainly top 500 million worldwide. Or is that not enough scratch to make it worthwhile? Tim, dear brother, first of all, thanks a lot for the question, Tim. Uh, appreciate oh, he's gonna it. I disagree. Uh, oh my gosh. Okay. <laughs> 500 million? Are you insane? Uh, no, no, no. There are there are much smarter people than both you and I put together, Tim, who run these studios who do nothing but analyze and understand what properties would make and where it would make it. And if they thought that any property, if they thought, you know, Snitch, the detached foreskin creature, could somehow generate $300 million, they would make that movie tomorrow. Uh, and they know that a Doctor Who movie would not make anywhere near that money. But let's get back. First of all, I'm not really quite sure about your numbers where you're saying it was like 138th out of 142 market. I, I don't think that's correct. Now, I don't know a lot about television, but the numbers that I read suggested that Veronica Mars had somewhere between two and three million viewers per episode. That is like double the amount of viewers that shows like Supernatural and Arrow have. So I, I, it wasn't one of the last place ranked shows. Uh, shows that are in the bottom five out of 150 shows don't get three seasons. So I'm not quite sure where you got your numbers from. Maybe I'm wrong, but we'll, we'll have to double check it. Hey guys, if you like this video, hit the thumbs up button and make sure you subscribe to our AMC Movie News YouTube channel. It's free and we'll keep you up to date on all the latest movie news, as well as our daily AMC Movie Talk Show. Also, be sure to follow us on Facebook and Twitter to find out about our special promotions, contests, and prize giveaways.